Hello, Internet, and welcome back! Today, we are going to be working on a Friday Mash Challenge, which was Gnome and Tiger and Narwhal. Uh, this Friday Mash Challenge was from months ago, weeks ago. Uh, for those of you who don't know what Friday Mash Challenge is, uh, Meg's Mashables, who I will link down in the description below, she's an awesome artist. Uh, she live streams every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and on Friday, we do a thing called a Friday Match Challenge, where we all in the chat will vote for, uh, uh, whatever elements we want to add into it. So, say you want, uh, St. Bernard, you would say St. Bernard in the chat, we'll put it on a wheel and we'll spin the wheel, and whatever the wheel lands on, we normally spin it about twice. Those are the two elements we add to our final Friday Mash Challenge. And this one, I believe it's, it was so long ago, this was like from last year, I believe, and it was when we were doing three. Sometimes we'll do three, a lot, most of the time we'll do two. And it was super fun, and the file has been sitting here, waiting to be editing, edited and not edited. But, uh, welcome back. I hope you guys enjoyed Mermay and My Sonic June, as this will be up afterwards. And I'm just like, it's the beginning of June for me, and all of My Sonic stuff is edited. All, all of June's content's edited. So, we're gonna go ahead and just continue editing my backlog and all that. But with this one, I wanted to try to do something kind of fun with my Friday Mesh Challenge, which I do for a lot of them, which is to take the elements and add them to a Sonic character and design a Sonic character based on that. I kind of really enjoy doing that in a kind of sense. And he has cookies. I don't think they got a name. I think somebody named them, but I don't recall. I would have to go deep into the recesses of the, uh, blah, 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 Discord server to find it. Because, like I said, this was made forever ago. But I hope you guys like them. Even though I can't remember their name. They have a name, I just do not recall it. But they, they are cute, precious bean. But yeah. Yeah, he, he has no name. But this was for the first week of January. I, I dug through the recesses of it. When this is me just gathering my references, looking at my things. Uh, instead of like the horn being for the tooth, I just made it on the head because that's where I thought narwhal horns were originally as a child and I'm just going to keep that going instead of it being an overgrown tooth that just exudes from the body. But yeah. Hopefully everyone's doing well, staying healthy. I absolutely adore drawing this guy. In his cute little shirt. I, I still struggle with drawing beards. So that's why the beard looks kind of wonky. But I had a great time. And then his tray of cookies. Because I'm just like, he's here. He's got cookies. He lives in his little cabin in the woods. Just chilling out. Every so often he'll walk the long distance to the store. He'll go buy his groceries. He's a very sweet dude. He's very cute. I really love this guy. They, they don't have a name, and right now I'm thinking the name Timothy. I don't know why specifically Timothy is what I'm thinking. I know uh, my father's name. His middle name is Timothy or Timmy. My dad hates that middle name. 
So it might just be because he's wearing boots and he has the button-up kind of like flannel shirt that my dad always kind of wears. And it's just Timmy. Also, a Timothy sounds like just the nice guy. He, Timothy is either Timmy don't get in the van or Timothy is just, I've lived, I've survived, I did not go into the van. And now I'm just over here making cookies in my house. I'm just chilling out. I'm going to sit on my, in my rocking chair on my front porch, drink my soda pop, and be very happy and content with life. Th that's what I think of when I think of Timothy. But yeah. I, I can't believe it's taken five, six months for me to edit this video footage. But, yeah, you know how it goes. But, uh, if any of you guys don't know Meg, go check her out. I will link her down in the description down below and in the comment section. Uh, Meg has a YouTube channel. She does not use it very much. Uh, but Meg is on TikTok. All of her socials are under Meg's Mashables. So just Google Meg's Mashables and her site should show up. She, she makes these cute stickers. I bought some. What Meg does, uh, people who, who know me via Twitch, you'll know. But what Meg does is she'll take an element, she'll take two or three animals and match them together. And it becomes its own little creature. And so Friday Match Challenge is fun because, like, we all kind of, like, we suggest things kind of like, um, what is it called? Improv, kind of like improv. We all suggest an element. It goes on a wheel. We spin the wheel twice. Whatever it lands on, those are the elements we use. And Meg will make it on stream within like three hours. Beautiful piece. Don't know how she does it. And then we have a week to make it and then put it in the Discord, post it to Instagram, all that stuff. And so, yeah. And then, uh... So that's fun. And Meg also has like these beautiful, beautiful stickers of like cute punny things. Like I believe her most recent one as the time of me recording this is Garden Thicket. That's going on pre-order. She's got uh, the uh, Veggie Fails, which is a portito. Portito. It's cute. Jalapeno. Which is precious. Uh... And almost all those things have butts on them. Very cute little chibi butts. That precious. Uh, one of her favorite matchables she's uh, done that I actually have merch of is of a sushi cat. The, they are precious. She's made uh, cork. I'm pretty sure you've all seen my cork. I have a cork. I have two of them. I have Sharky and Barky. And... They are precious. They are a mashable Meg made of a cork, a corgi, and a shark. My brain is going dead. So I'm just going to tell you about Meg's mashables throughout the most of this. Because I have no, like, general news to share at the moment. But she's made a corgi and a shark. She's made a cork bee, which is a corgi and a bee mashable. She should, at some point... Uh, she is planning on making a second stuffed animal. The cork was her first one that she did last year. She's planning on making a second one that's going to be of her, uh, Parasic Park. And Parasic Park is her dinosaur cat mashables. So, like, she has a pterodactyl and I believe it's a Siamese cat, uh, mashable that I don't remember the name of. It's probably pterodactyl. I am not good with words right now, and wordplay and puns, but Meg makes really awesome things. You guys should totally go check out her stuff. I will link her down below in the comment section and my description. I'll try to tag her. I'm trying to figure out how that tagging function works, but yeah, you guys should totally check her out. She doesn't have a lot of stuff on YouTube yet, other than, like, some upload of some, like, Twitch VODs. But still, she she is awesome, and you guys should totally check her out. Her community is super, super family-friendly, 
which you'll notice throughout this whole entire video, I have been trying to be a good little Chrissy and not say horrible bad words. Because Meg is family friendly, and I am not, and I shall keep all of my little sailor words to myself for this one video. And then the rest of the videos that aren't necessarily art that I did for the Friday Mash Challenge with Meg, I can say all the bad words I want. <laughs> Just, I, I try to keep that distinction, and Meg likes to keep that distinction, and I will respect it. And I hope that you will all respect it as well. And this is me just adding detail because horns have grooves and such on them. So it was very, very necessary that I add the details. But yeah, there's my cute, adorable, adorable guy. So precious. But yeah, Meg also has other mashables. Most are cute. Some are abominations. Uh, the Snedgy is my favorite, and it's also a favorite of a couple of other people in uh, Meg's Mashables community. Meg does not like the Snedgy. But everyone is allowed that one piece that you don't like for her. It's snedgy. I love it. It's precious. But yeah. It's just precious. Let me show you what other things she's made. She made a bee duck mashable. That was cute. She's... Some kind of like, I don't know what it's called. It's from Star Wars. It's this little penguin thing that's super cute. Uh, I believe it's like a pog. Pork, pork. She mashed out with a mermaid earlier in May. So y'all should check it out. And here's the final piece. Thank y'all for being here. And many thanks to my Patreon and Kofi supporters, Diamond Class and Micah. You guys are awesome. Thank you very much for helping support me be able to make the things I make. Alright, bye-bye!